I mean, look at this. Look at that tower. This is so cool. Yo, look at how these characters look. I mean, it looks really cool. Let's let's be honest. It looks pretty dope, but my my frames are getting hammered. This is like I think I have less than 60 right now. Yo, what's up, guys? It's T-Bag, and welcome back to Battlefield 2042. Now, I didn't think I would play this game anytime soon, but I'm gonna try some new stuff out. New stuff to have some fun in this game, actually. So, for the people who don't know, on PC, if you have an Nvidia graphics card, you have these Nvidia game filters, and these are actually really cool. You have things like the depth of field which you can change as you can see right here which is really cool you have a lot of different stuff for example things like this i don't even know what what stuff this is like a comic overlay and all of this is real time in game and i think that this is really cool but what i'm gonna focus on in this video is this one right here now i don't know if you can tell but this is basically like an oil painting it has a new look you know what i mean it has a new art style now and obviously this is gonna make things a lot more difficult to play with but it's gonna be fun I, it looks really cool look at the clouds man it is legit an oil painting let's see how we can play with this so anyway we're gonna start off normally obviously without any filters and let's say every time we die i'm gonna increase the potato graphics by like 10 percent oh and everything you see in this video everything is inspired by fabian chills he did a video on this like a little while ago so i will link his video in the description down below be sure to check it out like i said all credit definitely goes to him i'm making sure to use the sniper now because when the filters are enabled it's gonna be very difficult to see people from range so this is probably the best i can do for now nice you know what let's grab this thing damn this thing is weak Okay, so far so good. I actually want to die a couple of times so I can increase the uh, weird graphics, but I'm gonna stick to the challenge. There's a guy up here and nobody kills him? What the hell? Oh, there are loads of people here. If only I could turn this thing around. Oh, I actually got it. Okay, so anyway, we died once, so that means we're gonna increase the potato graphics. Okay, so check it out. This is obviously without anything, and this is with, let's say, 10% enabled. You saw the little difference? This is off, and this is on. It's not much, but it already has a little bit of an effect. You can, it's like the whole art style has been changed. Now, honestly, I think it looks pretty cool. Obviously, this is not gonna help me in performing well, but that's obviously not the point. We actually got a kill, I can't believe it. By the way, drop a like if you want me to do this challenge in Warzone. Like, after every kill I get, I increase this potato graphics. Should be fun. Again. Bye. Okay, time to increase the potato graphics by another 10%. There we go. Look the difference between this and this and this. Okay, this is this is gonna be fun. I don't know if it's gonna be fun, but it's gonna be very hard for sure. Look, I can't even. That's an enemy. That's an enemy, right? How you? No, there's no way I can beat these guys like this. I'm having real difficulties seeing what's actually going on. That's an enemy, that's for sure. Oh, I got one. I got one. If he didn't shoot at me, I would not have seen him. So he killed himself, basically. That's that's an enemy. That's an enemy. That's an enemy. I always didn't see them. Oh, that's not fair. Two against one, but I got the stupid shield guy. Look, look, he doesn't know. My my uh, my spawn beacon is right there. He doesn't know. The ballistic shield is a one-hit kill? Yo, look at how these characters look. That is so cool. I legit find this extremely dope. I think this is really cool. Let's try a team deathmatch. You know, close quarters. That gives us a little bit of a chance. Because from up close... As you can see, you can still see people. Not that much, but you can you can see them. Wow, it actually works, I can believe it. If I remember correctly, there was some sort of setting which was also 
uh, had also something to do with the NVIDIA filters. And in Battlefield 5 you would actually have a big advantage because there was a setting that you can basically turn off all the foliage and stuff like that. I don't really remember how it exactly was, but it was broken. But this is nothing like it, that's for sure. And for some reason we're actually kind of slain. Bro, we haven't died once. Bro, we are on a like, uh, I don't know, 8 kill streak with these potato graphics? I consider that a win. Oh, there was a lot of people! Well guys, you know the rules, time to increase it yet again. This is 20%, this is 30%. I mean, it looks really cool. Let's let's be honest, it looks pretty dope, but my, my frames are getting hammered. This is like, I think I have less than 60 right now. And I still get you people, unbelievable. It's impossible to see to see enemies from, from a distance. I knew it, I knew it. I saw something on the ground and I thought it was a uh, spawn beacon, but I wasn't for I wasn't sure. <laughs> Dude, it's such a weird experience playing like this. Bruh. I can't even see my score. I, le I legit can't see my score. I got 11 kills and one death. So, in my opinion, we're doing pretty well. I'm gonna increase the potato graphics one final time. Just, you know, just to show you guys the difference. This is without... This is with the potato fillers. I can't even see my red dot. I can't even see a, a crosser or anything. I mean, look at this. Look at that tower. This is so cool. I got one. I got a kill. I got a kill. I can't believe it. Can we get more? Oh, that's AI. Okay, well, you know what? I'll take the AI kills. That's an AI as well. I mean, look how this looks! All the character models are so... Well, like an oil painting! And I actually think it's cool, but okay, I said it like 20 times right now. Okay, now you can really see how distorted the image is. I mean, you can't even see any facial features on these on these icons. That is absolutely amazing. Okay, and to finish the video off, you know, we're actually gonna turn this thing off. And, you know, oh, this is obviously such... You don't even... You don't see the frames. But I get full 144 frames again, and it feels really good. There we go. There we go, another one. Okay, finally, this stupid game is over. But it was a lot of fun. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, please drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can join the Discord, the link for that is down below. And with that being said, I see you guys next time. We'll